Hey. Naked. You wanna buy a tutorial? It's only 50 dark dollars. That's what that is. That's what the D stands for. Dark. Sure. Wow, they're awfully shifty, aren't they? R really? You'll really buy it? <laughs> right this way, gent gentle nurse. Huh. Interesting. I don't know if I should be afraid or what. They're an odd bunch, these. Why is there just like a hole in the ground, too? Are you gonna push me down it or something? We're sorry, we're normally puzzle guys, but... We've been forced to do tutorials just to make ends meet. Oh, I'm so sorry. When the king got power, he fired everyone and replaced all puzzle makers with him. Ruxel's card? Lord of the Puzzles. Be careful. So this king that's sort of taken power and jailed all the other kings... Didn't... Shom? I'm just gonna say Seem. I'm sorry, I'm saying Seem. I don't know if when they said their name is pronounced Shom, if that was just a joke or a joke, but also the truth. I don't know. But I'm gonna call them Seem. Didn't Seem say that the king had a son? I'm guessing that would be Lancer. Whole goals. One buck, monthly tutorial, weekly. Ten bucks, weekly tutorial, monthly. Hundred bucks, stop making tutorials. <laughs> what? Uh. Well, if I pay him a hundred dark bucks, then they won't have to make tutorials and they can go back to doing puzzles? Right? I'm TP Master. Ask me about TPs. Whoa, look at their face swim around in their body. Okay, I actually do want to know more about TP. I know it's the magic juice that powers spells, but what the hell does TP actually stand for? What's TP? That's what lets you cast spells, see? When you see that orange bar, cast some spells when it's filled up far. TP, it's quite a caper. TP stands for toilet paper. N no, it stands for tension points. Oh. What, really? <laughs> uh, how do I gain TP, exactly? When you defend- oh, right, defending does it. Protect yourself, then cast spells. Also get TP by getting close to bullets. Look for the heart outline when you get close to bullets. You rhymed bullets with bullets. Because it's important. Oh, so that's what the extra big, what I thought, hitbox was. It's not actually a hitbox. It's the game, like, absorb energy box. Okay, that's strange, actually. Because it really feels like I'm getting hit. I think that's going to be very confusing. TP only lasts inside a fight. Once you win, it's out of sight. Having extra feels unbearable. No point in saving, it's straight up terrible. But leftover TP turns into extra money at the end of battle. You mean I only should have been using one square? Oh. So there is a point to saving it. Ralsei Master, ask me about... Ralsei's? Ralsei's? Ralsei, did you come off a production line? Fact. Ralsei loves when you give us money. He will hug you and call you... Honey. H hey, that's not true. You don't need money to get me to do that. Aw. Healing. Ralsei has a spell that heals. Dude, why use that when you can eat food? Because you won't have to use up an item. I could have avoided all those empty calories? I, I think we already know this about Rolsey. 
<laughs> Pacify. Rossi's spell called Pacify. Use it on babies before they cry. What? It safely removes a tired enemy from combat. What if you're fighting a baby? I like how they have increasing hats on their puzzle pieces. Susie Master. Uh, I won't do all of them, but do the ones that I think might be interesting. Fact. Susie loves when you give us money. She will. Nope, don't care. Did I say something funny? Warning. When Chris uses warning, Susie can't hit. So make sure to... So there's no reason to use it. Unless... Unless you want it not to hurt. So there's no reason. Chris Master. It's a good idea to give us bucks. It'll make you happy and fill you with lux. Over there is our donation hole. We had a box, but it got stole. <laughs> Reviving. When HP goes to negative, your friends fall down, but bringing them back is easy town. Plain foods and spells work like a charm, and with a mint you can cure all harm. Even normal items and spells can revive people, huh? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, interesting. So it's not the end of the world if someone dies during combat. Acting. If you only act, you might start to think, what about the guy with the scarf in pink? If you know acting will make the enemy friendly, then you can ask me to spare on the same turn. Oh. I see. I see, that's a very good tip. I didn't think about that. Or cast pacify if you know they'll get tired. If you plan ahead, a lot can happen in one turn. Hey, who's the master here, me or you? If you like her tutorials, please throw your money into a hole. Wait. I can only throw in one dollar increments? I planned on giving a hundred dollars, though. The hole became full. It's filled to the brim with cash. Really? Just from one dollar? So that's gonna give me monthly tutorial weekly or something? Or gonna give them the ability to make a monthly tutorial weekly or something? I don't know. The king didn't even give us severance pay. His son just gave us all beanies. Itchy beanies. Oh, that's what those are. They're beanies. They're not like top hats. I'm so sorry. It's a lone door frame, but for some reason you can't see through it. Huh. Well, flip my flapjacks. The clowns are back in towns. I added the S. Well, bad news, since you last saw me several minutes ago, I've created a brand new fighting team ready to stop you. Not even the purple girl can stop me now. <laughs> Are you ready to be... Stop. Stop talking. Ho ho ho. What is that? Why are you saying that? Ho ho ho. It's my evil laugh. Scary, right? You sound like baby Santa Claus. Uh, you mean, like, in a badass way? Shut up. You <laughs> doing another one of these, okay. You really think you know how to be scary? Well, I... Wrong. Man, wannabe tough guys like you really piss me off. Face it. You wouldn't know scary if it picked you up and bit your face off. 
That's not true. Oh, really? Then why don't we prove it? We'll start with the part where your face gets bit off. Oh, okay, I get it. Thank you, purple girl. What? Thanks, it was kind of you. To teach me how to be scary, with an evil laugh. Hey, I wasn't... And now... You're going to be thrashed. That's better laugh. Merry Christmas. I guess that's kind of an improvement. Board of Jigsaws blocked the way. They look so strange. What what is on the top of their heads and why are they crying? They look like they're in horrible agony. I'm so sorry. Befriend. Should I check them? Yeah. And, well, there's no point in trying to spare with you, I guess, defense? Yeah. Attack 5, DF 0, it's... This mercenary is only fighting to make ends meet. Oh, I'm sorry. Mercenary? Oh. Barry! They got Barry! No! Jigsaw is trying to calculate this month's rent! Okay, um... Hmm. Okay, if Chris... So if I want to avoid killing them, I need to warn them. Right? But if I warn them with Chris, so that Susie can't attack, then both my turn and Susie's turn is wasted, and that only leaves Ralsei. So how do I do anything with Ralsei? Just defend? Until... Uh, do the enemies just eventually get tired? And then I can use their pacify? You and Ralsei warned the enemies about Susie. Everyone went on guard. Fighting? I love fighting. Jigsaw is wishing it could quit its job. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep doing that to see if they get tired. Warned. Oh. Oh, they stay warned. Oh, I see. Okay, thank God. That's good to know. Um. Alright, speed friend. And then, I guess I'll assume that it's gonna make it sparable? You barely lifted a finger and... What the... Well, if we have to be friends, what's, what happened to them? Nice. We're friends now. Aww. Okay, um, I just want to check that they're still warned, yes. I wonder if that lasts the entire fight. It probably does, the warned status. Yeah, okay. Sixty-nine dark bucks. Nice. Oh, look, Chris, another puzzle. No, oh, no. Let's read the instructions. D the instructions are vandalized. It says, Thou'st fools, thou will never figure it out now. Ruining instructions. That's definitely against the rules. Then it uh, says, P.S. I make my own rules. R.K. Well, that explains that. 
why don't we just climb over the spiked fence? Uh, because then we'd get impaled and die? Cool. I'll work on that, and you do the puzzle. Uh, try your best, Chris. So, we have, like, two boxes, water, and two thingies. Oh, I'm... I just put the boxes over with the switches simultaneously, right? Great job, Chris. I think you're onto something. Hey, Chris. Give up whenever you feel like it. It's all good. No, I think, think I got it. You did it, Chris. Great job. Damn. Didn't get to impale myself. Oh, well. Come on, jumps. Good job, Chris. Look at these pillars. I wonder if we're getting close to the castle? Are we heading in the direction of the castle? Various guys appeared. Okay, so the first thing we always have to do... <laughs> it's kind of funny, the first thing we always have to do is warn everybody. Yeah, it really... I get that I didn't actually take any damage there, but I got 8% TP. But it really sounds like I'm taking damage. I mean, I see a thing appear around my heart, I hear a little tick tick tick. That's a weird mechanic. Like, I get, I get mechanically that it's trying to reward you for being kind of daring, right? Adding a little bit of strategy to the dodging beyond just dodging. But at the same time, it just seems really confusing. Uh, I will convince... well... Is the middle one more... more difficult than the other ones? The Hathi or whatever? Yeah, let's let's do the Hathi. Flatter. And I will spare you. Rudine has no strong opinions one way or the other. Long live the guy who pays us! It smells like jewelry. Does jewelry have a smell? Hold on, that seems to be where we're supposed to go. So what's up here? Oh, maybe this is where we're supposed to go. From the bottom, the order of our rooms in Card Castle. Of course, if you haven't been there, you won't know it. Oh. Okay, so you do have to go the other way first. The order of our rooms in Card Castle from the bottom. Right. Oh. Why did you come back? Yeah. Wow. I avoided him. When you step into the light, you'll return to where you were before. So I gotta get through without touching the light, right? Let's just test it. Yep.
Oh, I see. I see. So I got to do this. Whoa. Hi there. Pondman drew near. Gotta warn them first. <laughs> smells like a pawn shop. Let's check him. Yeah, let's check him. And defend. Attack eight, defense zero. Its nucleus doubles as an eye spot. I don't understand what that means. Nucleus doubles as an eye spot. That was terrible dodging. Lullaby. Good night. Lullaby? Aww. Pawnman fell asleep. Sus <laughs> Susie fell asleep. The enemies became tired. Well, I'm fine with Susie falling asleep. Pawnman can't keep its eye open. So you can't spare them if they're just sleepy, right? I can spare the top one, right? Because it's actually asleep. The bottom one's sleepy, but not asleep. So let's spare the top one, and then with you... Pass... Uh, not that. Pacify the bottom one. So you've begun to cross the great board. The halfway point to our castle. Hmm. Impressive. So, it's a shame. You won't make it a step further. Because my guys are about to smash you into blood. Lots of blood. Splooshing blood. Very gross and bad. Hey, purple girl. Was that scarier? Why are you asking me? Because you're really cool at being terrifying. I want to be as scary as you. You want to be like me? Yeah. Well, that's stupid. But, uh... The new laugh isn't as awful. And saying you turn us into blood is, uh... Cool. What the hell is up with the bucket, though? It's to put the blood in. Oh. Yeah, I'm not, uh, supposed to make a mess. Anyway, thanks for your feedback. I'm really feeling scary. Uh, no problem, I guess. So, are your guys gonna attack us, or...? Oh, yeah. I was so excited I forgot to bring any guys. Uh, but next time, it'll be the end for... Hey, I've just been calling you guys clowns. Does your team have an official name or something? Oh, Chris, we should come up with a name. No, we shouldn't. Then it's decided. Everyone puts a name in the bucket. All right. Everyone's put in their entries. Blue person, you can choose. Since you look like you don't care. Crumpled paper, neat paper, lancer labeled paper. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> uh, so Lancer ones from Lancer, neat papers from Ralsei, and crumpled paper must be from Susie. And I didn't put one in the bucket. Hmm. Let's go with Susie's, just because I'm curious. You take the crumpled up piece of paper. You open it up. Okay, and your name is... Hmm. I don't think I'm allowed to say this one. It's pronounced... The... Dollar exclamation mark dollar squad? I can't say that. Whoa, I'm not allowed to say tier two swear words. Wow, Q3's collective dad must be very cool. Uh, could we perhaps consider a different name? Relsi, you don't have to be in our squad. Yeah, how about I be in the squad and you be the bad guy? Here, call up my dad. Tell him he has a new son. <laughs> One that has to take a shower every time he reads a swear word. Okay, fine. We can keep the name. I just won't say it. See you, losers. It's shower time. So wait, is that itself a swear word, or is that just like a censored version of the actual word? Excla no, money, money exclamation mark. Or, or, how do you actually say that symbol? The money symbol, the currency symbol. Currency exclamation mark currency? Oh, currency exclamation mark question mark squad. I, that's like so unpleasant to say. I'm never calling ourselves that. I'm just going to say the squad. It's interesting that it's not on this top black one. I just got to move two steps each time. Or like right here, and then two steps, and then two steps. Technically, I can move one step, but then that would just be kind of a waste of time. Okay. Oh, hello. gaze enigmatically. Should I do a lullaby? I wonder if there's a chance it could put Chris to sleep, not just Susie, because that would be very bad. Susie, it's fine. It doesn't matter. Let's, let's try it. Yeah, just Susie. I like that Susie's so sleepy. Sleepy girl. Got one to spare. Uh, yeah, so I'll spare the first one, then with Ralsei. Ralsei. Oh, I don't have enough TP to do anything like that. Uh, hmm. I guess just defend? Can I go back? And, yeah, I can go back. Good. Okay, instead of sparing with you, then... For the second one, let's do good night, whatever that is. I don't think I've actually done that yet, so that should be interesting. And then with Ralsei, I'll spare the first one. He whispered good night to Pawnman. It fell asleep! Aw! Everyone's so sleepy. Ooh, Ralsei's taking a bit of damage. I think I want to try something, actually. Yeah. Hmm. Let's try this. I'll spare you. And... I need 32% to heal, so let's just generate enough TP that I can heal. 
Just defend. Okay, maybe not worth it if I just take more damage. Hi. Whoa there, horsey. Pawn men are scary, but all all in their doing is following the king. Us on the board used to have our own boss. Those were peaceful times. But now even the boss has been reduced to the king's peon. My name? Mr. Elegance. <laughs> and these? These are my nostrils, not my eyes. Oh. Oh, I really thought they were your eyes. I can still see out of them, though. <laughs> okay. Fear not. We, unlike the simple pawnmen, possess full faculty over our actions. I, Mr. Society, am far too intelligent to ever bow down to such a tyrant. Unless he asks me. He's very scary, you see. What, you think you possess the power to topple that brute? Yes, yes, I'm sure everyone will support you. Go for it. Just as long as I don't have to participate. Oh, you're back to the ho-ho-ho, huh? W well, step on my boots. If it isn't the name I'm not allowed to say. You boys or girls had better turn back while you can. Lancer, what is it this time? I'm simply warning you. Something extremely dangerous is lying ahead. It's actually really inconvenient. I can't go home at all because I'm so scared. What is it? Oh, hey, little guy. That? That's what you're afraid of? W wow, purple girl. You aren't scared? C why would I be? What's it gonna do? Uh, well, normally. Oh, no. It crushes people to death, I think. Hmm. Here it comes. <laughs> All those huge feet. Big boy. <laughs> 